الحمد لله وكفى وسلام على عباده الذين اصطفى اما بعد ان شاء الله تعالى today we will go through some of the practice questions on the themes that we have covered so far to make sure that we understand and we are getting clued up with some of the new terminologies new ideas new concepts so first we need to make these indefinite nouns into definite ones take change them into definite by adding lam tarif by adding the particle which is al in arabic but it's actually the lam yes so for example these are the noun that you could see some masculine some feminine ummun mother obviously it's a feminine word because mum is mother feminine so if you want to make it into marifa by adding al how would you do that you would say al ummu without having tanween there likewise kurrasa rounded ta there this is a feminine word al kurrasatu lawhun al lawh maktabun al maktabu tanween drops you just pronounce one letter if it was maktaban you would say al maktaba if it was maktabin you would say al maktabi so declension remains the same but you change the nation means double sound which is tanween sound you change it into one of those letters no two dhamma but one rahimun you change it into ar rahimu ar rahimu because this is shamsi letter sun letter maktabu that was qamari which is al maktabu baytun al baytu ghurfatun al ghurfa al ghurfatu obviously when you stop it becomes ha so al ghurfa bintun al bint or al bintu tifl at tifl al tifl becomes at tifl you have to put lam there but you pronounce pa straight jidarun al jidar jidar means wall child girl room house mother notebook tablet to write on board desk and merciful sister brother ukhtun al ukhtu akhun al akhu yeah do the same so this is mansub state now there was dhammatan there here we have fathatan means two fathas two zabars so al arba al arnaba at taira obviously you remove that two zabars ha remains because rounded ta becomes ha you know so you do not pronounce you do not say tairatan you say yeah if you want to continue you can say tairatan so otherwise you will say at taira tu at tairata in this case one fatha at tairata but when you stop you change that rounded ta into ha at taira baqara baqaratan al baqarata sawaban al sawaba with fatha only jannatan al jannata khubzan al khubza daran al dara zamban al zamba rasulan al rasula with fatha no alif you don't add alif you only add alif if there were two zabars ard ard arnab rabbit taira plain baqara cow sawaba sawab reward janna garden khubz bread da house zam sin rasul rasul messenger haub pond al hauba hawa al hawa air So this is how you would write al arda without alif al arnaba at taira al baqara yeah what one fatha 
والثواب الجنة Okay What about if they were in majroor state Same thing Wardatin Rose Uyunin Which is plural of Ayn Means Springs Fountains Yameen Yameen Right Sama Sky Kitab Book Jarida Magazines Papers Zahra Flower Tawila Table Noor Light So you say Al-Warda Al-Wardati Al-Uyuni Al-Yamini Al-Samai Al-Kitabi Al-Jaridati Al-Zahrati Al-Tawilati Al-Nuri I think we would have covered Shamsi and Qamari letters which is Moon and Sun letters if not, then that would be coming soon. Certain words, when you pronounce with al, you go on to the first letter of the word rather than pronouncing al. And they're certain that you pronounce al. It's al qamar. Qamar means the moon. Al qamaru, al qamaru, al shamsu, wal qamaru, al shamsu. You do not say al shamsu. You say al shamsu without pronouncing lam. So that is why the letters that you can go straight on to without pronouncing lam there, they are called shamsi letter, ashamsu. And there's certain where you have to pronounce lam. So for qamar, moon, you have to pronounce lam, al qamar. So that's why they are called, this group is called shamsi, this group is called qamari. So annahifu. How do you know that? It's just a practice, but there are there is a mnemonic to memorize it. There's a there's a certain letter. They would they will always be like this in this category or that category. Nahif, annahif. Nahif means weak, frail. Radi. Radi is like waste, you know, rubbish, bad, bad stuff, not good. Ready in that sense. Something which is good is jayid. Ready, mm, it's not good, bad. Asir, short. Muhandis, engineer. Ibn, son. Rabi, someone who is a bit like, you know, weak mentally. So, opposite of intelligent. So someone a little bit unintelligent. Weak in memory. Weak in intellect. Duffer. Mustaqil. Someone who is woken up, alert, awake. Kafir. Disbeliever. Someone who rejects. Khadim. Servant. Hadir. Present. So what they're asking, they want us to change them into feminine. So Nahif, masculine. You just add around it the Nahifah. Nahifatun. Radi, Radiatun. Qasir, Qasiratun, Muhandis, Muhandis, Muhandisatun. But you pronounce, when you stop at that ha, you would say Muhandisa. Ibnun, Ibna. Rabijun, Rabijah. Rabijatun. Mustaiqidun, Mustaiqidah. Mustaiqidatun. Kafir, Kafir, Kafiratun. Kafirah. Khadim, Khadimah. Hadir, Hadirah. Nazif, clean. Nazifah. Mu'min, believer, mu'mina. Okay? So you do not pronounce that rounded ta, but you make it into ha when you stop. Tathniya, change them into dual form. Dual form is when you have ani, aini, aini, but this is rajulun, marfu state, so you say ani. So Rajulani, two men. Imra'atani, two women. Al-Mar'atani, Al-Mar'atani, two women, same thing. Imra'a and Mar'a, they both used for feminine. Woman, a woman. So Al-Mar'atani and Imra'atani. Obviously with Al, it becomes definite. Tiflun, child, baby. Tiflani, Tilmidun, student. Tilmizani, pupil. 
الكتف شولدر الكتفان كعب انكل الكع بالوداوت ال سوري كعبان جنه جاردن جنتان تو جاردنز وجن الجنتين دان المعلمه ذا تيتشر المعلمتان معلمتان مؤنث استاذ يو هاف تو اد اني افتر ذات المؤمن ذا بليفر المؤمنان تو اوف ذم صادق ذا تروثفول صادقان العاقل العاقلان اوكي then change the noun to the sound masculine plural jama mudhakkar salim jama mudhakkar salim and jama plural is three or more and mudhakkar for masculine salim when the structure remains all you have to do is looking at the states you just change into una mean adding una at the end or ina ina so mu'minun is marfu state with dhammatan its counterpart is una so you just say mu'minun believer a believer mu'minuna many believers yeah plural form abid the worshiper abiduna sajid the one who does sajda the one who prostrates sajiduna plural raki'un the one who bows down prostrates means he does the rukur so bows down bend down a bit راكعون صائم صائمون راكعون صائمون صائم the one who fasts قائم the one who stands up قائمون خاشع the one who fears singular خاشعون plural شاكر the one who is thankful grateful شاكرون صابر patient صابرون كافر كافرون منافق hypocrite منافقون جاهل ignorant جاهلون okay easy and for these change them into sound feminine مؤنث سالم So we're making them into plural form, yeah. Mu'minah, mu'minatun, mu'minah. When you stop, it becomes ha, mu'minah. So the plural would be atun, atin, atin. So you say mu'minatun, mu'minatun, qanitatun, qanitah, qanitah, obedient, qanitatun, someone who submits, submits. Qanitatun, sadiqah, the truthful one, sadiqati. صادقات صادقات صابرة the patient صابرات plural خاشعة the one who fears the female yeah. خاشعات متصدقة the one who spends متصدقات صائمة the one who fasts صائمات 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 when you stop حافظة the one who protects the one who protects القرآن is hafil the one who memorizes and thereby protecting quran is hafil hafidah hafidatun zakir the one who remembers the one who does zikr of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala zakir zakirah muannath zakiratun plural form walidah mother walidatun murdi'a the one who breastfeeds the nurse foster mother wet wet nurse for the baby murdi'ah murdi'atun murabbiya the one who nurtures murabbiya murabbiyatun muallima teacher female teacher muallimatun plural mumarrida nurse female nurse mumarridatun atun 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 that's what he add in marfu state tilmiza tilmizatun easy okay So here you would find certain examples. So the first one is 
for muzakkar we change it into muannas you remember this is jumla ismiya so jumla ismiya is when you have two nouns together first one is called mubtada second one is khabar mubtada khabar mubtada and khabar they work together in a way that the construction is that muqtada is definite and khabar is nakira means indefinite generally and there are exception to that which we will cover inshallah after this initial bit so the first part muqtada is ma'rifa any of the seven categories of ma'rifa so al ibnu so it actually should be read i live you but leave that for the time being why that is we we don't go into that detail but it is actually i live you okay i live you the son the boy is salihun righteous where did we get that is from in the construction if the first part which is mubtada and is ism and is ma'rifa and second part is ism and nakira and they're both in the marfu state generally even if the state is changed for an external reason that's fine but as long as they have this construction of marifa and nakira on both are ism then this construction gives you that idea of saying or adding is mr depending on the number depending on the context whatever is suitable so al ibnu means al ibnu salihun al ibnu salih al ibnu salih al ibnu salihun the boy is righteous so we change it into feminine alibnatu salihatun see to so you change both muzakkars into muannas the girl is righteous al abu karim the father is karim honorable someone who caters for others someone who is generous al abu karim al umm father mother umm al umm the mother is karimatun karima when you stop karima al walad the boy is tayyib is good tayyib al bint bint is the girl is tayyibatun when you stop tayyiba al bint tayyiba The girl is good, nice. A rajulu sadiq. The man is sadiq. Means truthful. Al maratu. The lady is sadiqa, sadiqa, sadiqatun, sadiqa. Marifa nakra. Al waladu zakiyun. The boy is zaki. Means. intelligent the boy is, is intelligent so al bintu zakiyatun the counterpart would be that next al mumarridu nashitun the male nurse is nashit nashit means active agile very enthusiastic okay al mumarridatu mun nashitah nashitatun when you stop nashitah al mumarridatu nashita al jaddu maridh the grandfather is sick marid al jaddatu the grandmother is maridah sick huwa mudarris he is a teacher hiya mudarrisa see so this huwa is dhamir and dhamir pronoun is is from the categories of ma'rifa that's why huwa is ma'rifa mudarris is nakira same construction mubtada khabar he is mudarris a teacher she is hiya mudarrisa a teacher al maliku adil the king is just the king is just al malikatu adila the queen is just adilatun المؤمن صادق the believer is truthful المؤمنه the believing woman is صادقه 
المدير شديد the principal is principal the head teacher master the principal is شديد strict المديرة شديدة female principal is strict المهندس عراقي the engineer is Iraqi from Iraq المهندسة عراقية the female is female from Iraq okay good identify noun with details so you have got certain words there what are the well, maraja is fails so ignore the al bahrain how do you know this is ism because there's al here and this is in any 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 construction that suggests that this is tasmiya and this is with al ma'rifa so that's noun bashir al sabirin al sabirin is ism bashir is amat wa innahum inna is particle hum is dhamir which is ma'rifa Lana na is Bamir as well, but we leave that. La ra irun, ra irun, ra irun, angry. So this is behind two rivers. La ra irun, ra irun, ra is, is. This is again una, ina, ina, un. Someone who is very much in anger. So this is ism. Fi hima, fi particle hima is huwa huma hum huma. Yeah. This. Catering from fi, we call it, we say it or pronounce it fi hima rather than fi huma. So to make it easy. Ainan tasmi, ainan, two springs. Nabba khatan, two. Yeah, again, ani, ani, both as ani. Tasmiya, tasmiya. Nakira, nakira. So they are, mausuf sifat, but they are also noun. Walil kafirina. Kafirin, una, ina, 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 kafirin. Azabun, ism, alimun, ism, mausuf sifat again. So this is how you would identify how many asma are there. And then here you go. Al Bahraini, ma'rifa, because of lam tarif, al mu'arraf bil lam, is tasniya and is mudakkar. As sabirin, ma'rifa, lam tarif, jama salim, and mudakkar. So if, if it's murakkab, then you would. Suggest that is murakkab. Hum is ma'rifa, bamir, jama, mudakkar. Na, ma'rifa, bamir, jama, mudakkar. And monas both because na goes for both. We. Ghaizun, nakira, jama, salim, mudakkar. Huma is actually huwa, huma, hum. That was ma'rifa, bamir, tasniya. And is mudakkar, monas both. They both have the same bamir. Aina, nakira, tasniya, muannas, sima'i. There's no rule there, there's no, there is a rule, but this is for higher level, inshallah ta'ala. Mawsuf and nabdakhatan is nakira, tasmiya, mu'annas, because of ta, nabdakha, nabdakhata, so nabdakha, kha, and nabdakhatan. And this is sifa, mawsuf sifa, so it becomes murakab, tawsifi al-kafirin, mudakka, jama salim, ma'rifa. So this is how you look at each word and try to find out what is the, you know which of the four things you can put in that particular ism means you have to pick one from all four levels we haven't covered the declension yet so at the moment we're just talking about these three and obviously if there are any of the known murakkabat that you have learned so far okay so you, you go through that on your own just practice, try to work out what you think, how many asma you can identify, what is their state, what is their gender, how many are there. You know, this is, this is a bit of a uh, brainstorming and hopefully with working either in teams or on your own, you'll be able to learn it better, inshallah ta'ala. Okay, let's leave that there. There, I think last week, there was one bit that was missing to be completed. I wanted to do it this week, but maybe leave it for next week because we would revise that slide again, inshallah. Okay, let's go on to Kitabul Asasi.
stylist. So they just want you to know these words and their meaning. Marid is patient. Tabib is doctor. Mishrat is the scalpel, the lancet, the one that you use to cut a knife. Samaa, stethoscope. Sarir, bed. Suq, market. At tadribu thalis, third exercise. So you have to identify the body parts. This is your eye. Eye is called ayn. This is nose, anf. This is mouth, thumb, qalb, heart. This is, I think this is wrist they're showing. So wrist is rusakh, rusakh. So rusakh is wahid, rusghun. And uh, then you have, I think these are fingers they're talking about, or maybe, yeah, finger. Or hand, maybe hand, the first one. This one should be hand, maybe. All of that together is yad. And these are fingers. Fingers are called, one is called isba, and plural is asabi. And then I think this is what they mean. Yeah, leg, which is rigid. And this is, I think, foot. So, qadam. This is some ibham. This is forearm, zira, and this is, I think, chest is pointing to sada, neck, unuk, and I don't think shoulder could be shoulder, but I think shoulder is a bit too low here, so it should be cut if here. Anyway, hair, if it's hair, then sha'ar. If it's head, then ra's. Okay. At tadribu rabi'ah. This is just a way to write ta for those who do not know how to write Arabic. Ayin, just to see how it's written in the middle and at the beginning. And showing how dal and noon when you write. There will be difference of a dot at the top or at the bottom. At Tadribu Sadis. Practice again to see how you say a sentence. Yaf Hasut Tabibu al The doctor is assessing or examining the patient. Yaf Hasu Fahasa Yaf Hasu, the doctor. At Tabibu, the doctor. Yaf Hasu examining at Tabibu. Mariyadha al Mariyadha, the patient. Yumsiku Tabibu, the doctor is holding a samaa, samaata, fail, file, mafool, a samaa, stethoscope. Al Mariyadhu, Yanamu al Asari, the patient is Muttada, Yanamu al Asari, sleeping on the bed. Whole sentence becomes the cover of Al Mariyadhu. يتناول المريض الدواء the مريض the patient is taking the medicine الدواء مفعول المدرس يمسك القلم المدرس يمسك الكتاب so this is the right one المدرس يمسك الكتاب because he's holding book I think yeah what is book كان بقلم not مساحة مساحة is sitting there the duster eraser, Tabashir must be jokes here somewhere, but anyway. Addar Sussamin Al Maida table, table for food, dining table, Al Maida Milaka spoon, Shauka fork. Shauka is used for thorn as well as in the hadith of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Shauka. Sikkin, knife. Tabak, plate. Dawraq, jug, pitcher. Kub, cup. Finjan, again, cup, but a little bit. So it, actually, kub you can call a mug, and this is more of a cup. Malaha. Malaha is where you put milh. Milh is salt. So the salt bottle or pot. 
منضدة سمول ستول ثلاجة ريفريجريتر كبريت ماتش ماتش ستيك صابون صوب yeah. leave that. So just try to memorize those words that they're becoming every so often but we need to know those inshallah to improve our vocabulary in qasas al nabiyyin ila al ghaba to the jungle wa fariha al ikhwatu kathiran the brothers became happy a lot they became Came very happy. Lama when Adina Yaqubu li Yusufa. When Yaqub permitted or allowed for Yusuf, mean gave permission for Yusuf to go with them to play. Wadahabu, so they all went ila rabatin to the jungle, what to a jungle, wa al kaw and they threw Yusufa, Yusuf alayhi salam, fi bi'irin in the well, fil rabati in the jungle in the forest walam yarhamu and they did not show mercy yusuf upon yusuf as-saghira the young yusuf did not show any mercy to young yusuf walam yarhamu yaquba and they did not show any remorse compassion to yaqub al-shaykh al-kabir old man wa kana yusuf waladan saghira and yusuf al-islam was a young boy وكان قلبه صغيرا and his heart was young small he was little كانت ال... وكانت البئر عميقة and the well was deep وكانت البئر مظلمة and the well was dark وكان يوسف وحيدا and يوسف عليه السلام was in all by himself وحيد alone he was alone there ولكن الله but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala بشر يوسف Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave the glad tidings to Yusuf alayhi salam, the good news, وقال, and he said له, to him, لا تحزن ولا تخف. Do not grieve and do not be afraid or do not be fearful. إن الله معك. Indeed, Allah is with you. وسيكون لك شأن. And indeed, very soon you will have a special merit. سيحضر إليك الإخوة. Very soon your brothers الإخوة will come to you. They will present themselves to you. They will be present in your, you know, court. They will be with you. They will come to you. وتخبرهم and you will tell them بما فعلوه whatever they have done means what they are doing now. You will in future tell them when they come to you. You'll be able to tell them exactly what they have done. What they did to you. وَلَمَّا فَرَغُوا And when the brothers done, were done with the من شأنهم from their job, whatever they planned, mean throwing in the young brother Yusuf Islam into the well. So when they're done with that, when they finished the job, Yusuf القوا يوسف وألقوا يوسف and they have dropped Yusuf or thrown Yusuf في البئر in the well. اجتمعوا they gathered together وقالوا and they just said ماذا نقول لأبينا what do we say to our father what will we say to our father قال بعضهم some of them said كان أبونا يقول أخاف أن يأكله الذئب one of them said some of them said our father used to say كان أبونا our father used to say يقول used to say our father used to say أخاف I fear أن يأكله الذئب that the wolf will eat him. فنقول, so we will say, له, we will say to him, صدقت يا أبانا. You spoke the truth, O oh our father. قد أكله الذئب. Indeed, the wolf has eaten him. Devoured him. وافق الإخوة على ذلك. They all agreed. The brothers agreed on this. وقال, وقالوا نعم. And they said yes. نقول له يا أبانا. We will say to him, O oh our father, يا أبانا. قد أكله الذئب. Indeed, the wolf has eaten him. 
قال بعض الإخوان some of the brothers one of the brothers said or some of the brothers said ولكن ما آية ذلك but what is the sign for it what is the evidence قالوا they said آية ذلك الدم sign of this is blood the evidence is the blood وأخذ الإخوة كبشا so the brothers grabbed a sheep they, they were shepherds and they had sheep وذبحوه and they slaughtered him وأخذوا and they took قميص يوسف the shirt of Yusuf وصبغوه and they stained him with the blood they colored him with the blood وفرح الإخوة جدا the brothers became very happy وقالوا and they said الآن now يصدق أبونا our father would verify testify us they would he would confirm what we do you mean he would believe in it he would believe what we are saying أمام يعقوب in front of يعقوب عليه السلام مضاف مضاف له جاءوا وجاءوا أباهم عشاء يبكون قالوا يا أبانا إنا ذهبنا نستبق إنا ذهبنا نستبق وتركنا يوسف عند متاعنا فأكله الذئب وجاءوا على قميصه بدم كذب So they came to their father at night time crying They said O oh, our father indeed we went on to race each other and we left while we left Yusuf al Islam near our goods our stuff so the wolf ate him and they brought the shirt with a false blood I mean obviously that that blood wasn't the blood of Yusuf al Islam so they brought the shirt with the blood on it, with blood, a false blood on it. And they said, هذا دم يوسف. This is Yusuf's blood. وكان أبوه يعقوب نبيا. And Yusuf, Yaqub al Islam, their father Yaqub al Islam was a prophet. وكان شيخا كبيرا. He was old enough. وكان عاقلا من أولاد. And he was more knowledgeable and intelligent, more intelligent than them, than the children, than his children. وكان يعقوب يعقوب الاسلام يعرف he knew أن الذئب that the wolf إذا أكل إنسانا when it eats the ذئب when it eats any man جرحه he wounds him he causes him injury وشق قميصه and he tears the shirt وكان قميص يوسف سالما while the قميص of Yusuf the shirt of Yusuf was intact there was no tear there they didn't realize that that was a big mistake they've done. And Allah made them do it. وَكَانَ مَزْبُوغًا فِي الدَّمْ It was colored with blood. فَعَرَفَ يَعْقُوبُ يَعْقُوبُ الْإِسْلَامِ Realized and he understood أَنَّهُ دَمٌ كَذِبٌ This is a false blood. وَأَنَّ قِصَّةَ الذِّئْبِ And that the story of ذِئْبِ is قِصَّةٌ مَوْضُوعَ is a concocted, concocted tale, a fabricated story. فَقَالَ so he said, لأولاده, to his children, بل هذه قصة, but rather this is a story, وضعتموها, which you have fabricated. فصبر جميل. So patience is good, is beautiful. What means I, I will be patient. وحزن يعقوب على يوسف حزنا شديدا. So Yaqub alayhi salam became Grief became grieved means Yaqub alayhi salam grieved on Yusuf alayhi salam means on the loss of Yusuf alayhi salam for the loss of Yusuf alayhi salam for missing Yusuf alayhi salam he became very upset. Huznan shadid and he had a lot of huzn means he was very much depressed. Walakinahu. But he sabara, he showed patient, sabran jamil and a very good patient. He became very patient, sabran jamil. Inshallah, I will leave it there. 
اقول قولي هذا واستغفر الله لي ولكم ولسائر المسلمين فاستغفروه انه هو الغفور الرحيم والسلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته